Are, do you are, do you need medical attention? Do you have uh, eyesight medical issues? What's going on? Have, uh, eyesight issues? What's going on? No, the mini stroke? What's going on with you? You lost sight of me. Good thing Watkins is right next to a hospital. He's not doing very well. Okay, Watch me, pedestrian. Respect my authority. Everybody try this at home. Okay, so I amended this to include all comms between uh, these, especially these three officers. You're getting this, the uh, sergeant out here. So there's that form. And uh, how soon do you think they'll be back in touch with me? Uh, it just depends on how business prices are. Um, usually we respond uh, within 10 days. Okay. Yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and submit this to them. I'm okay. I'm going to give you a call once I hear something back. Okay, perfect. Any? Right. Okay, sir. Uh, I wanted to get, uh, I'm putting in a couple of public records requests. Okay. Uh, for an incident that took place on the 9th. Okay. This sergeant is making $336,000 a year. No wonder why my fine was so high. Okay. And I wanted to know if I could get, um, per SB 1421, records on Shepman, Sprague, and Watkins. What kind of records? Uh, their disciplinary records. You would have to contact Internal Affairs for that stuff? Sorry. That would be your recourse to get that information. I don't okay. have access to that. Where are they in this building? You could try and contact Sergeant Kirby or Lieutenant Grisafi. How do you spell that? G-R-I-S-A-F-E, Kirby, K-I-R-B-Y. Okay. They would be the ones that be able to help me with that? Yes, sir. Okay. Uh, all right, great. Thanks. All right. Thanks. Okay. Thanks. All right, that's it. Um, So here's the letter that I received from the city of Pasadena police chief citing they're not going to be releasing the body cam footage, the radio comms, or any of the personnel records as per SB 1421. So if this doesn't say that the city of Pasadena has something to hide, I don't know what does. This is zero transparency in writing kits. Johnny's favorite shirt. You're welcome. <laughs> so here we are at the outside payment window. We don't even need to go inside. City of Pasadena and the LA Superior Court system has made it very convenient for us to pay our fine in the middle of the sunny day. Okay. Oh okay. look everybody, look what's right. behind That's me. Okay. I can do the That's the Pasadena Public Library. Sorry. No pictures of can I help you? I'm sorry, sir, but we can't have filming with that. No, I can't be sh that. No, I can't be sh How much is the fine? It is $197. And if you think that's a crazy amount for jaywalking, jaywalking you are Here we go. Let's zoom in. Yes, thank you very much. I appreciate your help. Seeing is believing, kids. Here we go, here we go. This is how, he's on an incline. <laughs> oh my gosh, you better catch it. It's hard to get up there. I have the money. It's just not clear. Excuse us. Thank you. Have a nice day. Stay. Okay, well then get another job. He just said he doesn't want to be filmed. If you're going to film, he's not going to help you. Okay, here it goes. Uh, this is Pasadena, is this the courthouse? Uh, yeah, this is the courthouse. Okay, hold on. Oh, sorry, I wasn't even paying attention. Here we go. Take a look at that suitcase. Okay, show them your what you're scooping with. Oh. You want some Johnny little product Bravo. placement. He's scooping with his own cup. Uh, That's the what she said.
The clerk will be with you shortly, okay? Thank you. What's your name? What's your name? Clerk will be with me shortly. No, he won't. He just said he wouldn't. Stop resisting! Stop resisting! See, the problem with giving retaliatory tickets is every time I come back to your city, I will make sure that you remember me. Oh, and just so everybody knows, this is not about the pennies. This is because the guy didn't want to be recorded. Right, this is because he didn't want to be recorded. Yeah, this isn't even about the pennies. Right, we haven't even gotten to the issue of loose change here in pennies. Oh yeah, no, there's people because the window's right back here. There's people right here. Uh... If I were a waiter and you walked in and I didn't like how you look, I'm trying to pay you pennies here. That's very cool. <laughs> Stop resisting! Take my money! City of Pasadena! Take my money! They're refusing to take my money. $197 jaywalking ticket paid in pennies. And the clerk refuses service because he doesn't want to be on film. He's already on film inside. There we go, everybody get a shot. If I walked off my job, do you think that that would, would, would go over well with my superiors? Traffic window, cash and checks only. Cash and checks only. Got cash. I've got cash. Lots of it. Uh-oh, here comes the law. Boop. Boop. Okay, they, here's where they send all the police. <laughs> yeah, boy. Oh, you're trying to pay something? That's all we're trying to find out. You know the cops are full of it when they say stuff like, that's all we're trying to find out. They're trying to get my name to run me for warrants so they can arrest me and stop this scene. Hey, Einstein, take a look for yourself. What do you think? Do you have the citation? Einstein, you take a look. You think it looks like I'm trying to pay money? Do you have Einstein, the are you try does it look like I'm trying to pay money? Sir, yeah, does, sir, so get this guy back on his job. Does Get this clerk back on his job. What's your name? Saldivar. What's your name? Deputy Saldivar. Saldivar. S-A-L-D-I-V-A-R. How about you? Buchanan. Buchanan. Mm -hmm. What's your What's your uh, badge number? Right here. I can't read it. What's your badge number? Speak. It's right here. Speak. It's right here. It's the policy of the Los Angeles County Sheriff's Department to verbally give their name and badge number when asked by a member of the public who inquires. This is a common power play with tyrants from coast to coast. To give you some perspective on the scale of the LA Sheriff's Department, there are 2,850 jail jurisdictions in the United States and LA County jail system is the largest of them all. LA County holds more inmates in custody than all jails in each of 37 states. The budget for LASD is $3.4 billion and they still can't afford body cams and dash cams. It's not that they can't afford it, they simply don't want to be held accountable. The LA Sheriff's Department is one of the biggest laughing stocks of all law enforcement nationwide. Why would one agency not want to be held accountable when time after time body cameras have exonerated officers in a court of law? As most of you know, the number one person in the department, Sheriff Lee Baca, is headed to prison and his undersheriff, Paul Tanaka, is already in prison for hiding an inmate who was an FBI informant within the LA County jail system. LA County sheriffs rape, murder at will, and have actual gangs within their ranks. One of those gangs is called the Banditos, based in East Los Angeles. Do some research for yourself. You will be shocked. Speak, servant. How about you? It's right here. Speak. No, Tell you, me your badge. It is not your policy to state your badge and name a badge I number. I need you to yell at me. I'm talking to you professionally, boss. Okay. okay. No, you're not talking to me professionally. A professional officer would state his badge number. They're simply here to get my name to run me for warrants. 
Also, they wind up sending four guys out here with guns to try to solve this issue. Who wouldn't take that as a hostile gesture? Talk about escalating a scene. If you have the form or the citation, we, we're more than willing to help you. So you are? He yeah. just abandoned his post. Well, Because I had a camera form. running. That's fine. I mean, that's enough. You, you have every right to film. All right? Okay, so? so if you have the form. Uh-oh. Hey, lady, can you help me? Lady. What's your name? Los Angeles County Superior Court should be ashamed of their lack of training with their employees. What's your name, lady? Look, look at all these people. They're just walking away. This is this is what you I call mean, service. But if you have the form, I can give it to them to show oh. to show what to turn. To there's there's right there with the man bun. What's up, man bun? Tell me your name. Are you afraid of cameras? What did you say? Is that what you said? No, I don't. Listen, we haven't even gotten that far. We need to have somebody at the fucking window. Do you have the uh, Dude, no, uh, we need to. We need somebody at the window first who's willing to work at their job. They're willing to work. They're not willing to work. He just abandoned his post for ten the, minutes. The port where you can put in. Listen, there's a speaker right there. Do you not know how this works? Give him the case number and everything like that. Do you know how this work doesn't you. work? Yes, what I is do. your pro? He just abandoned his post for 10 minutes. Well, maybe his supervisor right there. Maybe his supervisor just to told, just schooled him on what his job is, well, that's right? She maybe went to go get a supervisor. There, oh, well, a supervisor. right. And she told him that I'm allowed to be doing what I'm doing. I understand that. And then tell are, him to get back to work. Get out, get out of here. You don't have to yell at me. Well, right? you don't have to come out here with a gun. There's three guys with guns here. Let's face it, the initial jaywalking ticket was a threat of violence against me. Don't think so for yourself? Try not paying a traffic citation and see what happens. So when they knew I was coming to give them the money in a way that was unpreferable to them, they made an extreme show of force as an attempt to threaten and intimidate me and even possibly deterring me from carrying out my legal obligation of paying this fine. If the only tool you have is a hammer, you tend to treat everything as if it were a nail. I'm trying to help There's you. three, well tell him to get back to work. That's how you can help it me. Looks like he's trying to get back to work. All right, well then you can get back to work and you can get back I'm inside. Get right back now. inside. Trying to find out get what get inside. Go okay. back, go, right. go, go, be gone. I don't have be gone, I, I be gone. I want. You can stay. You, yeah, I can stay here. That's not a problem. I'm not interfering with, with whatever you're trying to do. All right, I'm not interfering. I'm just trying to help you out and speed up the process. That's all I'm trying to do. Okay. All right? Okay, are we able to proceed? Yeah, no? Take it over, your license number. Oh. Is that a yes or a no, sir? I need your license or your ticket number, sir. Okay, ready? What is your problem, dude? Do you not know your job? You got a good, you got an education on the job for fun and for free. The next one gets an invoice. Jesus. What's your name? Hi, my name is Sergeant Herrera. Sergeant Guerrera? Herrera. Herrera. Herrera? Would you like to make a payment? I'm try well, I'm trying to make a payment. He we'll abandoned his happen. post. Okay, well, we'll make it happen. Is this what, is this the money that you're turning What's your in? badge number? Sir, my name is Sergeant Herrera. Okay, and I'm asking you. for your badge number okay, as well. Would you like to turn Sergeant me? Herrera, it is not the policy of the Los Angeles County Sheriff's Department. 416095. Was it that sir. difficult? Okay. Apparently sir. it was. Okay. Stop talking right now. Okay. I'm sir, talking. Being stop talking. Okay, is that a crime? Is that a crime? I'm being. Lady, you're not here to help me. You're here to run me for warrants so you can arrest me and end this PR nightmare with all of these people gathered around. I'm disrespectful. I'm I came you. here to pay okay. money. Okay, and I want to help you. and I want to help. This is just mind numbing. This is why you ask for a supervisor right off the bat. The only person that can help me pay this extortion fine is Mr. Man Bun, who abandoned his post over 13 minutes ago. Sergeant Herrera can only help me by having Man Bun get back to his post. This is how pathetically the LASD operates. 
Yeah. And he abandoned his post for 10 minutes. Okay, is this the money that you're turning in? And do you have the case number, sir? Yes, we all right here. All okay. Okay. Jesus okay. Christ, what a okay. show. You bring out four guys with guns because I'm trying to pay a fine. There's no need to be disrespectful, sir. Oh, no, it is a no show. It is, is how about when you shoot me in the head? Do you think that's disrespectful? That, that's disrespectful. You're right. You wouldn't shoot me in the head. You would shoot me in the back several times like your other boys in blue did in Long Beach with Noel Aguilar. That suit cost the city of Los Angeles over $3 million in the release of a gnarly video, which I will post in the description below. A video that can only be described as an execution. We're just trying to help you. Okay. There you go. Bye, Sergeant. Get back to work. Everybody get back to work. Oh, look, we got three guys. We actually have, we actually have a guy with a suit back there, too. We've got all the supervisors. I think we might have a judge here. Yeah, I'll take a look Yeah, hold on a minute. You're gonna have to move that out of the way so we can open it. Yeah. I... Well, you were busy abandoning your post, so. Yeah, you ready? Charlie, four, six. Are you, are you, are you with me or are you, are you against me? Char Olsen. $197 jaywalking ticket. Crime of the century. What's your name, sir? $197 jaywalking ticket that they won't take because I'm giving it in pennies. Oh, you're giving it in pennies? Hell yeah. Yeah, man. Come, look at this. Come take a look at what $197 worth of pennies looks like. And he abandoned his post because I had a camera. I had a dreaded oh, camera. I wanted to take a video of it. <laughs> uh, I wanted to take a video of it. <laughs> uh, oh my God. So those of you coming in late, 190, this is what $197 in pennies looks like. And I brought my, uh, because I'm a self-promotion whore, uh, I brought my in the neck coffee mug which can be found on Cafe Press forward slash J5. Hey, how are you? I'm Craig Blair, I'm the administrator here. Hey, how are you? Good, you're understanding, you're trying to pay a fine? Yeah, that's correct. Okay, we can take the coins, but they have to be rolled. Uh, no, this is legal tender. You're gonna, I, I understand you're gonna that, take, but... You're gonna, take, you're gonna take the coins. But our policy is... Yeah, your policy is not law. This is, a, this is legal tender of the United States of America. Your policy does not trump the, the ability that this is legal tender. I understand okay. that, but... No, you don't understand that. Otherwise, you would be taking my, my coins. Okay, I'll take them if they're rolled. Yeah. But I, I can't take it like this. You can... Yeah, you can. No, yes, not, you can. I'm not going to take it. No, you see, no, 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 you don't want to. Oh, you don't policy. want to. We don't have to. No, no, the policy, you don't want to take. No, you're going to take my money. Because no, it's now your money. This is now your money. And if you want, I'll dump it on the f***ing sidewalk here. And it becomes, this is your money. It's not my money, okay? No, this saying, is your money. If you want to pay. This is your money. What was your name again? My name's Greg Blair. Greg Blair. Okay, is your so camera what? running too? If you no. had it, it your way, be. what would we do? You can either roll it and then bring it in or pay in a different manner. What if it's rolled no. incorrectly? Well, well, then we'll figure that out and we'll notify. No. How would you figure that out? Well, we'd have to count it. But well, so you're, you're going to count, count it, it anyway. Yeah, God, you are the you, dumb, you are the dumbest so man the alive. Thing I've ever heard. You are the dumbest right, man well, alive. I'm going to I'm going to leave the so coins you here. Actually, take cash. Yeah. You should, you should reiterate that. I'm going to leave. I'm going to leave your. Rolled. I'm going to leave your money here. Okay. I'm going to leave your money. How does that sound? On or around October the 10th of 2019, I went to the Pasadena courthouse and asked for a 60-day extension which was granted. I also asked if the court took cash and coins. She said, yes, we take cash and coins. So if there is a policy against coins or a policy on how they will accept coins, then that policy needs to be available to the public. There are no signs at the payment windows. There is nowhere listed on the ticket, front or back, or anywhere online. Uh, 125 pounds worth, $197. God, this is going poorly. Oh my God. Maybe the city of Pasadena should have thought this one through. Maybe you don't give a 
uh, a convicted jaywalker a retaliatory speed of uh, jaywalking ticket. Also, come back and shower you in pennies. Also, pennies when you... from heaven. It says right here, cash and checks only. So that's what a hundred ninety-seven dollars worth of pennies looks like, kids. And it's all theirs. It's not my money. It's their money. Okay, and you can see there's no. Oh, there's one penny. My God. We're not limbers. Yep. All right, so let's get it all the way from the right. Hit the like button, you guys. Thank you for the super chat. Thanks to those who donated towards us $197 fund. I appreciate it. Uh, we gave them an overpayment so that they're going to have to mail me a check from the Los Angeles Superior Courthouse. So, so they brought four guys out with guns and then they said, stop yelling. You're, you know, trying to say that I was escalating things. Uh, no, but we brought four guys out here with guns, but So they're talking with two guys with guns. I'm sure they're conspiring on how they can arrest me. Get him with him. Get over there. Go on back there, man. Get over there. Will ya? He wants to kill me so bad he can taste it. You know they're just trying to find a way to uh, arrest me. So look, they're telling them if they close, they're gonna they're trying to close the window. So here's what they're gonna do. They're gonna roll down the window. And they're gonna make it look like the window's closed, even though this window isn't closed. They still have another hour and a half, two hours. 312, Monday, December 9. How you doing, Mr. Olson? I just want to let you know, I was going to give you the government code section, which is... Uh, that shows that legal tender is not legal tender? No, it's 68083 of the government code. Each salaried officer of the Superior Court shall charge, Can abandon his post? Collect and promptly deposit the fees allowed in each case as provided by law. No salaried officer who collects fees shall be required to accept coin in payment of those fees. Uh, that's like not true. I, I already you. have you on video. I came in here with a yep. video camera two months ago where the so, lady said I can take coins. You are the dumbest guy. So what I will do, I'll allow, I'll accept them if they're rolled. So if you want to take them you, and bring them back rolled, I'll accept them. The, oh. Wait, I'm confused. First, you say you'll take coins, but only rolled. Then about 20 minutes later, you cite a government code stating that you're not obligated to take coins, but you will make an exception in my case. Please get your policies and procedures down, Blair. You're an embarrassment. Oh, we got cam back. Do you even know how to run one of those? I'm getting cam back by an actual camcorder. Hey, look, good. Say goodbye to everybody that you guys are closing the window. Dereliction of, of duty, of service to the public. Oh my God, look at that. Oh, yeah, baby. They closed the window early. I tried to pay with $200 worth of pennies and they lost their minds. So they're open inside though, apparently. No, they just closed, they closed this because of a protest. I can't get all of these pennies out. There's a lip, there's a lip right here and I can't, I can't get these pennies out and So I'm not able to get all of the pennies. You don't think that they were conspiring for an arrest there, you're crazy. 
So today's the due date for my fine, and they know this. So they closed the outdoor window, forcing me to come through the x-ray machines and magnetometers. And nothing looks more like an ambush than an ambush.